Hey everybody. Today I'm gonna to show you how I made these courtesy ports underneath my Pedal Train Metro 20. That's so I could feed my DC cables underneath so they wouldn't go over the rail, maybe touching the floor, getting pinched off, or easily um, pulled out. So let's go out to the shed, check it out. I've got my marks here, I marked it with an awl. All right, safety goggles and gloves, of course. Go ahead and get it through. There she goes. All right, I'm back. Got the bigger bit in, I had to lower my table a little bit. And then I just don't need to go too far. Just lining up with a hole if I can get it straight. And she's binding up. Okay. Let's try that again. Probably go slow here. There she's back in. Oh, another bind up. It's trickier than I thought. Try three. It's catching on some. And she's through. All right. Oh, one half inch drill bit did perfect job. Now I got to do the other side. One thing I didn't take into consideration is this drill. Now I'm backwards, so let me see what I can do. And I flip the board around. Now my the lever that brings the drill bit down, the pedal board is in between that and the drill bit, so I don't have a lot of room. Just to show you, these tape marks are where the pedal, the power supply is going to go, and I left a little bit of room because I'm going to mount it a little bit differently than what how they screw it into the top. And I'll, sh I'll do another video on all that. And the thing is, once you commit, you're committed. That's it. Probably see the little hole there. And time to power through. Oh man, now I lost my grip. What happened? Let's see if I can repair. That's it, he's through. Whew. Might have been a little too up close, so I'm gonna try to pull the drill this way. And I got my buffer tape up here just to try to get it so it's not gonna scrape things up too much. Now I'm in, I'm pulling it up just a little bit. And she's bound up again. Good night. Uh, it's like a hassle in the castle here. All right. Pedal board destruction 101. that one so I'm gonna clean them up a little bit nice thing I didn't go through the top you don't see a thing on the top and they're not unsightly either so let's clean them up all right now I'm ready to finish this thing I've got some light steel wool I've got a little file half round half flat so it's kind of versatile two q-tips you know don't have to go out and buy a paintbrush for this small touch-up work. And some black primer. And I like the primer because it's flat. And this finish on this pedal board, like it's just primer anyway. So, anyways, here's my holes. They're a little rough. So maybe just a little better view here. Just going around on the insides and just getting them so they're smooth. This is taking off the big stuff. My gaffer's tape, it went through a little bit, but we'll touch that up. We'll take this stuff off. So, 
Feels pretty, pretty smooth. I'm gonna take my real fine steel wool, you know, you can get it right in there, go across it a little bit. There, okay. All right, gonna clean off all your little metal shards from the drill, tape markings, you don't need those anymore. Take your tape and clean the area. Looks like it marked through. Let's see if it did. Ah, yeah, it did. For this side, I got to touch up a little bit. You can take your steel wool and just really make that smooth. And those marks smoothed out and they're ready for touch up. Here's another good idea just before you do your painting. Here's a lens wipe. Open her up. You don't want to use water. You can use water, but if you use water, you're going to wait for it to dry, and then it's going to have moisture. This is alcohol-based, so it'll evaporate. I've got my primer. Shake it real good. I've got a paper plate here. This is my palette. And make yourself a nice, almost puddle or pool. And then... There's my board. Just get enough on there. Just enough. We'll do this little spot right here. There we go. Gone. One side, all touched up. Let's go to the other side. Let's go in the hole around here. Inside it. I'm looking for that spot up on the rail here that I hit. Ah, here it is. A little bit of it right up here on this edge. There, that's done. And that'll dry and it doesn't take long for this stuff to dry. But uh, again, there it is. You don't even see it. You wouldn't see it on a gig, not unsightly, and you've got yourself some courtesy ports. That's it, please subscribe to my videos. Thanks for tuning in and please subscribe to my videos.